Hello, my name is Joe LeBay, and thank you for viewing this video in the RatchetX video series. One of the innovative uses of our RatchetX product pertains to the areas of corporate and governmental compliance. This video will show you how RatchetX can be used to capture information on an application screen, apply compliance rules that are external to the application, and guide the user through the associated corrective action. In this example, let's pretend I'm an independent claims adjuster using a traditional Windows client-based claims processing application. The workflow is pretty straightforward. Representatives from the insurance companies with which I work assign auto claims to me via the claims application. I then receive those claims and process the claims by inspecting the vehicle, estimating the damage, renting a replacement vehicle, etc. Now, I deal with dozens of insurance carriers and I shouldn't expect any one claims management package to be able to enforce all the various rules and regulations that apply to processing claims for each carrier across all locales. Further, there is no way this commercial solution can possibly anticipate and enforce all of the compliance policies that have been established within my organization. So I'm going to use RatchetX to watch over my shoulder and review the claim data as I work with it in the application and alert me of any applicable compliance issues. So when I load a claim assignment, RatchetX immediately recognizes the screen, automatically extracts the data, and executes a series of compliance rules. The way I know RatchetX is active for this screen is by the presence of the RatchetX alert button in the application's title bar. RatchetX detects the carrier on this claim is State Farm Insurance and that the claimant lives in New York. Our company has a policy that states New York-based claimants are entitled to an automatic replacement vehicle if the carrier is State Farm Insurance. This being the case, RatchetX displays the replacement vehicle dialog informing me of the condition and allows me to rent the replacement vehicle. To reserve the vehicle, all I need to do is click the Reserve button. Great, the car has been reserved for the claimant. Now I can paste the details into my diary by navigating to the diary dialog and clicking the paste button. Further, if I wanted to, I could email the claimant the details of the reservation because I have his email address available from the application screen. Now I need to set an inspection date. Let's enter May 17th. When I do, RatchetX detects the date and validates it against our inspection rules. As you can see, New York State regulation requires that inspections be conducted within five days of the claim report date. In this case, I've scheduled the inspection seven days out. To remedy the situation, I can click the Set Date button, which will in turn set the inspection date to the 15th, or I can close the dialog and set the inspection date to any day within the five-day window. For now, I'll click the Set Date button and note that the date the inspection field is changed to the 15th. By the way, if I want to see more details about the inspection regulation, I can click the See Regulation button and RatchetX will load the law text in the browser for me. Now, let's say I have a question about this claim. I can click on the RatchetX button and execute the alert that allows me to collaborate with an underwriting expert. When I do, RatchetX determines which underwriting expert is best equipped to handle my question based on criteria such as type of claim, state, etc checks to see if that expert is available and establishes a screen sharing chat session with the expert. As you can see, I've been automatically connected to Alan Burton in underwriting who can see my screen and quickly address my questions about this claim. In these examples, RatchetX is intimately involved with keeping my interactions with this claim compliant with both corporate policies and government regulations without requiring me to make any changes to my claim system. Further, the compliance rules used in this scenario can be shared with pretty much any other application I use without writing a line of new code. That's pretty impressive. The point is, RatchetX can be used to help supplement your organization's compliance program by capturing the informal application transactions that previously went either unaudited or were dealt with retroactively after the problems occur. RatchetX gives you the ability to proactively catch these transactions in flight and deal with them before they become compliance issues. Well, thanks for your time, and if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to give us a call or drop us an email. As always, we'd love to hear from you.